The Royal Horticultural Society, RHS, announced the Clematis Megan will make its official debut at the flower show in May. The RHS has described the pink-purple Clematis as a very hardy plant. They also described it as a rich and opulent flower that really makes an impact when it is given the room to grow. Meghan is not the first royal to have had a flower named after her. After his birth Prince Louis also had a clematis named after him. The Georgie Boy Daffodil was unveiled at the Chelsea Flower Show in 2014 and was dedicated to Kate's eldest child. Diana also had a namesake flower in the form of the Princess of Wales Rose. Read more, Prince Harry Facebook shock Meghan Markle would want to avoid this This year's flower show is a particularly special one for the royals as Kate is unveiling her own back-to-nature garden. Kate is co-designed on behalf of the RHS and will be a woodland setting for families and communities. The RHS has said the garden has been inspired by childhood memories that are triggered by the natural world, as well as special moments that will be created and measured by families now and in the future. A spokeswoman from Kensington Palace said, the garden seeks to recapture for adults the sense of wonder and magic that they enjoyed as children, in addition to kindling excitement and a passion for nature in future generations. Wild planting and natural materials will be used to recreate a woof and wilderness where children and adults alike can feel closer to the great outdoors. Kate's first royal engagement of this year was visiting the King Henry's Walk Community Garden in Islington. She met volunteers who work on projects that bring the community together through the garden. RHS Director General Sue Biggs said, We could not be more thrilled or feel more honors that the Duchess of Sussex has co-designed our RHS garden at Chelsea Flower Show this year with award-winning landscape architects Andrew Davis and Adam White.